69 years old. I live in Clinton Hill and I'm very active in my community. I try to keep abreast on what is going on. My name is Monica and I live in Clinton Hill. I work locally at the Green Grape Wine Company. I used to be a personal trainer, so food and kind of food politics, and I'm interested in activism and politics, it's kind of a nice blend. My name is Betty. Uh -huh. I lived in the area around about 40 years. I lived here off and on for like 57 years. Our area have grocery stores that are rip off. I can't afford all the organic food because I'm retired and I'm on a fixed income. I like fresh vegetables and I like fresh fruit and they're very expensive. There really isn't a major supermarket in the area that people can easily shop for healthy food. But yeah, I definitely would prefer to buy local, but it's just so expensive. What happened, I have a godson. He comes over and if a sale is on in Red Hooks, we go to Red Hooks. If a sale is on in Clint Hill, we go to Clint Hill. And it's from store to store that we do this. And there's no really a, a fresh vegetable stand near where I live. Like cucumbers, they have a sale, five for a dollar. Out of the five, you probably only can get one that's eatable. And if I want more, I have to go back like on another day and push the, pull the shopping cart from Pathmark all the way to Myrtle in North Portland to get home. So it's really just like a balancing act, a lot of juggling, a lot of, a lot of grocery shopping at a lot of different places for small amounts of stuff. I think that a lot of the seniors are struggling with it because a lot of us have found out in our senior years that we have diabetes, that we have high cholesterol, and high blood pressure. And it's contributed to what we eat. Yes, I have high blood pressure. So it is um, very important for me to eat fresh vegetables because I cannot eat canned goods because the canned goods have a lot of sodium in them. Because I had cancer that, um in the throat, so I had radiation, so I only could eat certain things. Okay. I always have to leave the neighborhood. I'm gonna have to take the bus, 37 bus, to the food market, or I go down the path mark. You know, which one is cheaper? That's what I usually do. If there, if there were a food co-op, it would just, like, it would make our lives a lot easier because in a dream world, if we could shop in one place and get like great prices and good food and the things we want, then we wouldn't be running around like chickens with their heads cut off. It's just <laughs> right. like, this is the only solution we've found thus far. Right. So the idea of a food cop is like amazing. It's like, oh, like, yeah. yay, yeah. no more running around. But the whole point of food co-op, I just really like it just because like not only do you get this food for like a really cheap price, but also like everyone that's there is like contributing, you know, everyone's working together. I mean, it's, it's just not like you just go to a place and it's, you know, cheap food. No, it's like everyone's putting in their work and that's why it's cheap. So it's like this community service type deal plus cheap food. I mean, food and community service hand in hand. I mean, it's nothing wrong with that. Having a food cop would uh, change, would definitely change my life for the better in terms of variety. Right now, I kind of, I'm kind of forced to. If I want to eat healthy, it's kind of, I'm kind of forced to eat a very kind of plain diet. Um, so I think having a food cop will allow me to be able to have a lot of variety. I love cooking, and I love cooking for people. So I think that'll, it'll be, it'll be good to have easily accessible, fresh vegetables, fresh fruits, and fresh meats. So I think a food cop, there's a lot of opportunities to really better the neighborhood. Having a food co-op in the neighborhood would help the people in the area. They will be able to buy more fresh vegetables. They will be able to buy more fresh fruit. I think I would shop at a food co-op, yes. Affordable food, that would be nice because everything is gone up but your check. 